measurement is our top measurement, the male top measurement, which consists of the shirt and the caftan and even your bumper jacket. So the first measurement you take now is the neck measurement. You are taking the full roundness of the neck with one of your finger deep inside for ease. You are taking the shirt, the neck measurement. The next measurement now is your chest measurement. Your chest measurement, you are taking the full roundness of the chest, the top part of the chest is your chest measurement. You take the full roundness of your top chest as a chest measurement, like this. After taking the chest measurement, then you move to your back length to waist. Your back length to waist, you are taking from the knee down to the back, the part that is going, that is deep inside, which is your back length to waist. The next measurement now is your shoulder measurement. Your shoulder measurement, you are taking from where the neck drops to your shoulder blade. This is your shoulder measurement and this is your shoulder blade from where the neck drops to your shoulder blade. After doing that, then you move to your back again and you do the half back measurement. The half back measurement, you are taking from the neck down to where you have the armpit line. Roll a straight line with your hand and stop there. Then from that point, take the measurement down to the other end. This is the measurement you really need for your back half back measurement after doing the half back measurement your next measurement now is your sky depth your sky depth measurement you are taking from the nape down to where you have the half back measurement this side you are taking the length not the width so the length measurement of your sky depth is this after doing that the next measurement now is the length of your dress of your shirt so you are taking from the shoulder down to your desired length how long you want shirt or the captain to be so this is your desired length and you stop at that particular part and after doing that you now move to your sleeve measurement tell the customer to pose like this then you move to that part checking from your shoulder blade down to your desired length your desired sleeve length so this is desired sleeve length after taking this measurement the next one now is your sleeve width tell the customer to pose like this then you take the full roundness of that part. Make sure your tape rule is going out when it's coming in. So this is your sleep measurement, your weight measurement. So after doing that, the next measurement is your cough measurement. So always good you remove your wristwatch while taking the cough measurement. Take the full roundness of the cough with one of your finger tape inside and make sure you have proper ease for the cough measurement.